Well guys, thanks for joining me. In this episode of Muttered Duckers, we're going to go do bank pulls. It's uh, the best one I've ever done yet, uh, luck-wise. I catch quite a few fish. I uh, got, got a really nice flathead and uh, got everything all geared up to go again the next day with my daughters. And that's kind of when things cut loose. So this would have been on last Saturday. Today's Tuesday, July 3rd. Um, like I said, it was the best morning. Uh, caught nice fish, my personal best channel and my personal best flathead. And then rebaited all my hooks as I went through. I caught another one when I was coming back out in the morning. And so then Saturday during the day, I didn't go back out. It started storming. It wasn't even supposed to storm. And we got seven and a half inches in, I don't know, maybe eight hours. Uh, just north of us, they got 10 inches. Flash flood, my daughter got uh, stuck in a flash flood in her car. My other daughter was having a hard time getting through town, so I was out in it. It was a mess. It brought the already uh, flooded rivers up several feet. And uh, what I do for a living, I had to, to go out and monitor a bunch of our buildings and uh, um, park systems and stuff uh, for all the flooding and uh, then they were going to shut down the river everything was so high I knew my poles were buried um, some of the creeks and rivers raised four feet to seven feet to ten feet just overnight in that amount of time it was really I haven't seen anything like it before. So it was my last chance to try and go out and get my poles and I recovered 11 of them. I had 14 out. I'm pretty darn happy about that because it was bothering me. I didn't think I was going to be able to do it. Uh, a few of them I, I saw through the water and was able to pull them out and I caught one fish even on that and that would have been almost two days later. So. I think you'll enjoy this video, so. Pole number one. Looks like it's got a little bounce on it. And I ran it over. Oh, nice channel. Big one. Sorry about that. I'm trying to take video and uh, handle the boat and manage stuff. So, channel cat number one. in the boat another channel cat probably about a I don't know 18 incher well we got us a little flathead Pretty nice little guy. Get him on. Very 
little. Well, not little, little, but very good looking fish. I'll take it. All right. Got another one on. Boat where I need it. Oh, another flooded. Yeah. That guy really got it. You can see it right, it went through twice. He was not coming off, but. I think he's not real big, probably only a pound. I might keep him to eat. So yeah, that's gonna be a good one for eat. So. That'll be the only fish I've kept so far this year. And like I said, he's just a little guy. Um, so, we're doing pretty good today. We got another uh, heavy bobbin pole. It's always so fun to see that. Kind of nerve wracking when you're by yourself though because you don't want to run it over it up but that guy's bouncing around pretty good it's like Christmas oh that one's gonna be exciting they're usually pretty good size when they bury those poles that far down like that. So, just see what we end up with. Like I said, it's kind of hard running the boat and doing everything by yourself. Let's see what's on here. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh come on, oh, look at it, yeah, oh yeah, that's my biggest one yet, ah stupid boat, dang it. Yeah! Sorry guys for yelling into the camera, but uh, that is good stuff right there. Look at that guy. Oh. So, let's get him weighed and get him a picture. And get out of here. Oh yeah. Trying to get situated. Yeah, I wish I wasn't by myself right now. Yeah. You guys write your guesstimate. How much he weighs. So
If you can see that, it says 21.6. That is the biggest one I've ever caught. Get some pictures, move on. I am releasing him, so I'm just going to get a picture and then release him. Biggest one I've ever caught. Yeah. Checking them as I was leaving. I noticed one of the poles just this morning that I've already checked. Might be a little more bouncy than normal. And look what we got here. Another big old channel. Ugh. It might even be my biggest one yet. out of this thing and weigh it. You can see 11 11. This is my biggest one yet. Take a picture, and let him go. My biggest channel. So 11 pounds, 11 ounces. I can do this number too. Okay. Right. Been pretty quick. Look at the mouth on that guy. Big channel. I didn't have him out very long. There he goes. Alright. This turned out to be a really good day. All right, guys, I'm on pole recovery. I'm doing really good, way better than I thought I would. Uh, we've had major flooding. Um, this is probably the, on Monday, Tuesday. This is the third day out. I'm at my last pole just trying to find them. And I had one channel cat on there so far. 
So far I've only lost three poles and I'm going to do a slow search on the way back to see if uh, by chance uh, they pop up or I missed them, but it's, I'm not too sure. That will be the deal, but I'm going to release this guy. Yeah.